Good morning everyone. Just a quick introduction to today's video. We are doing another Disney video and this is actually from the first trip that we took in April when we first told the kids that we were pass holders and it was actually really fun on this day because even though it was our last day in the parks we did something for the first time that we've ever done since taking the kids to Disney, and that is doing more than one park in a day. We were actually able to go to three parks in this one day, and it was a first for us. We've never done park hopping before this. Now that we are annual pass holders, we were able to kind of explore and go to the different parks on this day. So when you guys watch this video, it is from April. I was still in my boot from my broken ankle, so that's why you see me hobbling along. We just wanted to check in really quick and um, just let you know, yes, we are still posting Disney stuff because we still have lots from uh, when we've gone. So we hope you enjoyed today's video and thanks again for watching. We are saying goodbye to one resort and we are headed over to another just for one night because we couldn't get this for the extra night. So we are out the door. Oh. Oh. We're out of here. All right guys, so we've checked in at the Swan Hotel and we actually are headed out and we're gonna try and hit possibly all four parks really quick just to see some back ways into the parks. Um, and we're going to start out by, I guess, if you walk over to the boardwalk, oh, that's yeah. <laughs> if you walk over to the boardwalk that is close to the Swan Hotel, you can catch one of the boats that go into Epcot. And then from Epcot, we might do a couple things and take the monorail over to Magic Kingdom. And then from Magic Kingdom, floor. Maybe, a bus to maybe a bus to Animal Kingdom. Anyway, so we're going to see if we're going to get all four parks in really quick and where we can go. It wasn't as long as a walk as I thought from the swan to the boat that goes over to Epcot. It's actually right here on property, so it's even easier than I thought. So we are excited about that. The boat leaves from the Swan Hotel, stops at the Yacht Club and everything, and then brings you into the International Gateway at Epcot. I'm just past security, and now we're getting ready to scan our magic bands. And if you'll notice, we're coming right in at um, Epcot World Showcase in between England and France. Jill's on her feet today. Today. Just a boot. And just like that, we're in England. Look at all the Kenya, you like England? I love England. Huh? I love England. I also love the English accent. <laughs> what about more like a Cockney accent? <laughs> the Cockney accent. We had to study all kinds of cookie when we did the Mary Poppins show. It's a little bit like a little grungier accent, right? Cockney, it's a little more, more, more dirty, more less proper. 
<laughs> All right, now we're going into Canada. What's your can Canadian accent? Don't ask me it's to do a Canadian accent. Cana uh -huh. Canadian is like out and about. A. We a. Say a a lot. A. <laughs> how, do, how about some fresh fish, eh? Is it like a French accent? No. Well, actually, French Canadian, yeah. Can kind of have a little bit of a French. Since it, no. I can only do um, proper British, um, Cockney, Australian, um, Australian, French. Yeah, uh, uh, French. I can do French. Can I do Russian? Russian. German. Can I do in German. Indian. Irish. Indian. Scottish. Scottish. <laughs> nine, nine, nine accents. That's cool. That's now, pretty. Yeah, here we are. Canada. Southern. You can do Southern U.S. too. And oh yeah. Ten accents. And what's the uh, minion? That's a different language, not an accent. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Bad jellyfish. Ow. How many times have we stung? I've been I've been stung a couple times. <laughs> You've been stung a couple times yes. too, haven't you? They're pretty though. Yeah. Watch, they're gonna run into each other. Boom. How come they don't zap each other? <laughs> Getting ready to meet Mickey. We haven't done this yet, this trip, so we have to always see Mickey before we leave. And with our new uh, annual passes, we also get free photo pass, so all of the pictures we do in the parks are free to us for download. Yeah. Connection to Magic Kingdom. And just like we met, we're at Magic Kingdom, ready to go do more Disney. Yep. More and more Disney every day. I could do Disney all day, every day. Every day? Uh -huh. Wouldn't you get tired of it at some point? Well, I don't know. <laughs> Maybe not, huh? Do the rides. It's so much fun. So there's a pass holder entrance for every park and sometimes it really doesn't, you don't really need it because the lines aren't long, but it is nice when the lines are long. Today we probably didn't don't need it. it anyway. it's fun. Yeah. I love this entryway, it's so pretty. Perfect timing, we just got here and the parade is starting.
the people pleaser. Oh yeah, we'll make it over there. We'll make it to, we'll make it to It's a Small World. I like this ride, because right about, you know, like, couple seconds here, we'll take off. Lincoln, here we go! Kenya? Okay, we're gonna see a great view of the castle coming around this corner. Here we go. Castle. I don't know why, but I love this ride. It's nice, cool breeze while you're riding around, and you can relax, you kind of take a load off while you just ride around the Tomorrowland. Tomorrowland is probably my favorite area too. You're not supposed to eat food while you're on this ride, though. And now we're going into Space Mountain. It's gonna get dark. And we're off the People Mover. What do you guys think of the People Mover? Love it. a little busier here today than it was when we were here on Monday but still not too bad this is Saturday traffic for you we're getting ready to do enchanted tales with Belle yes this is a fun kind of character meet-and-greet um, experience that you can have over at the Beauty and the Beast kind of it's in fantasy land and it's a really fun experience, and if you have any Beauty and the Beast fans, we highly recommend it. And now I have a part for everyone to play. It will be your job to make the sound of a horse galloping. We're all going to gallop just like this. Gallop, gallop. Oh, wonderful. That was pretty good. Sutanara, are you ready? We. Sutanara. Now, you have the hardest part of all. Throughout the entire tale... Don't move. <laughs> I'm joking. You will be marching soon enough. Now remember, Belle doesn't know you're here. So, shh. I shall call her in. And when she enters, we'll all shout, surprise! What a wonderful idea. Everyone remain quiet when I say now. We'll all shout, surprise! Oh, cut the light. But of course. Thank you. Oh, Belle, where are you, mademoiselle?
Say goodbye to that castle. See you real soon. Like next month soon. <laughs> it's a lot better when you don't have to say goodbye for a long time, huh? Yeah. You guys are Disney uh, professionals, I think. Oh yeah, we are. We got it. Look at my backpack. I have popcorn on one side and then a mini bag on the other side. See you real soon. So we're actually going to catch the bus from Magic Kingdom to Animal Kingdom. Uh, so we will have used pretty much every form of Disney transportation in one day, getting us to three parks. Pretty fun. Haven't tried that one yet. We are now on the bus leaving Magic Kingdom and taking it over to Animal Kingdom where the kids got a fast pass on the Nolly River Rapids. So, Holly River Rapids. So, um, we now are headed to our third park in one day. In the closet. We'll never know. And <laughs> you know. Look at your tray there. Oh, it says come. You're good. <clears throat> I'll be right back. 